do have one last question uh, as it's related to like this conversation that we're having, which is the storytelling NFT portion. Gifted, who's in the chat, I see him uh, up there right now. Uh, he is doing his alpha morning show Monday through Thursday. And that was the topic of today's morning show was storytelling NFT. So definition though of storytelling NFTs is the question that I have for you because basically the way I was kind of perceiving it, but I might have you know been wrong is like just an NFT project that can that tells a story really well. But what what is a requirement for an NFT to be a storyteller NFT just because I don't know too much about it. Do you have any insights there? Oh man, I am not I am the opposite end of a gatekeeper. Right. So I don't like to put rails on anything. I think like when it comes to storytelling NFTs, though, in my opinion, I think that like the NFTs hold some aspect of the storyline within them, whether that is they're capturing a moment like the beginning of the genesis of, a you know, a storyline that begins. And these are like kind of the, the, the core characters or whether it's. Uh, assets that play as, you know, voting tools to allow you to take part in a story, uh, or whether each of them is their own character that you can leverage in a greater storyline, like, you know, like my shirt uh, or my sweater, uh, Nuclear Nerds, right? Like I've got a couple nerds and they leverage the ability for, they want everyone to really take ownership of those NFTs and those characters and give them life. They give you a place to give them a bio and, and flesh out their story. And then you can put those characters up to be, you know, part of other people's stories and, and how do, do these stories like, you know, uh, come together and, and then become part of canon, right? Like when, mm. when, when, for anyone who's not a super geek, when it comes to, to storyline and lore, canon means like it's officially part of the storyline, right? So imagine you're just a fan of Star Wars and, you know, your Jedi is the one who gets this really cool story arc, whether it's it's a little like side piece or whether they get to grace, you know, the Millennium Falcon for a moment. Like I think that um, that's the power of storytelling NFTs, right? Like you can, I am ready for Nuclear Nerds, you know, season eight where mm. like I can then take my characters and and be like, yo, these are OG characters. They've been around, they've seen the war since day one and this is where their story is. And maybe there's this really cool story arc that then permeates like the brand and permeates what I'm doing and, and what I'm where, where other projects are at. Yo, it's Nifty Q. I hope you enjoyed that short clip from my interview. Each week I'm sitting down with some of the best founders in the industry to help you on your journey in NFTs and Web3. All the links to the podcast are in the description. Hope to see you there.